left off with like a pretty hype fight that's about to happen versus out about the earth dragon which i'm assuming is either Faye's brother or dad because wakaba said that it's a he right and this is also assuming that this is actually related to Faye, the earth dragon but it should be right i i i hope it actually is now aside from the spider's perspective we got a little bit more juicy plot on the human side because the only survivor was the shield guy. You know, Julius Nissan was like right-hand man. And it's like, hmm, only the tank survived? And the re reason for that is, yes, there's a phoenix plume. But uh, Julius said that only the tank should use the phoenix plume for whatever reason. Because that's already kind of sus. And he just survives. And it's like, hmm, the retelling of the story from his perspective, I don't trust it. I am being extra schizo, extra cautious. We have to be cautious about this. Now, the person that slayed the entire party for Yulius Nisama was a girl that is not Yuri. It is not the church girl, right? She just happens to have a similar hairstyle, right? Because she opened her eyes and used that like rot skill, right? I think it was like some kind of rot eye, which is interesting because Wakawa also has that skill and it was kind of like shown immediately after. It's like she used that skill, then we immediately transitioned back to the spider side and Wakawa used it and I was like, huh, interesting. I don't know. I don't know where we're going with this, but let's have the Ottawa fight today. Right into it. <laughs> Bro just does that Matrix style. That's right, the goal is to stay off the ground. Oh, whoa. it's following us, using their foothold sometimes. Unless it also has the same magic. No, it has the same magic, never mind. <laughs> One and two, our schizo friends. Wait, what? Do they have names? Wilco? Magic brain, number one and two. Roger, Wilco. No, their name's not Roger and Wilco, right? This is just like Roger, Ryokai. But like, I don't know what the fuck Wilco is. Oh, that's a lot. Our schizo friends are very useful, man. Dude, that HP regen's busted. I'm telling you, manifest Hades. We gotta use some kind of abyss magic to end it. After image. Yeah. Oh, yo, that might have been the best animation. Oh, and, and as soon as I say that, we go back to the CGI. But look at this. I like it whenever an anime animation has like black and white scenes. You know what I mean? Like right here. Stuff like this. When stuff like this integrates. Or like sometimes it does. And then we're back to CGI. Ooh, it's got a lot of portals too. Classic just ora 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 muda muda muda. It's getting pretty close. Uh. Oh, it's pretty close, huh? Manifest Hades. Annihilating Evil Eye. Right, that's the skill that not Yuri used on Yulius' party too. Dude, he's smart! All that prep time and he's still doing well. Deadly Poison Synthesis. Oh, that's a huge one. Man, I remember when we first figured out how to use synthesis and we were so happy about it. Now we got like torrential poison shit. Huh? Oh, we're repatching our webs. Can we use it to like make him sticky and like slow? Cautious spider. But like just dodging is not gonna do anything, right? What plan do you have? Wait! What, what are you doing? What is this? I, I don't know. What is it? Huh? Just a shitload of spider webs? Oh, we just had a huge net prepared. Wait, we might actually win with this. Wait! That's the gravity magic, I think. Is it? Never mind, it's called Phantom Pain. It just like makes them hurt. <laughs> Manifest Hades. Or Annihilating Eye. Or just a shitload of poison lances. 
What's the yellow one? I know the the purple is like poison, but what's the yellow one? What the fuck happened? I don't think the explosion was from us. Araba did something. Okay, he escaped with dragon breath. Lightning and water magic was the yellow stuff? Okay. Oh, why is he glowing? Uh, oh, that's a lot of levels. That's a lot of magic. Oh, that's a lot of skills. I don't know. Holy shit. So specifically to counter Wakaba. He goes, ready? Black magic resistance. So we can't use... Wait, I'm not... Well, black magic is not abyss magic, right? Yeah, this guy's super smart. He's very intelligent. He had over 40,000 skill points a second ago. Bro is more cautious. And like, Sung Jimu is not cautious, but you know how he could technically like stack a bunch of skill points? So bro was just stacking skill points just carefully. 40,000 because he was already so strong. So he's like, all right, now's the time to use it. Which is actually huge that Araba, who saved 40k points because he didn't consider anything else in this labyrinth a threat just yet, finally found somebody that was like, oh shit, I need to do this, right? So this is like huge props to Wakaba, right? Got a couple hundred left, okay. Dude, he's been waiting for so long. Yes, just to kill you. That's a huge accomplishment, like, isn't it? Yes, you're the biggest threat he's ever faced. You can do it, maybe. Manifest Hades! Whoa. We were staying off the ground, but that's just like following everything. Yeah, like... Staying off the ground doesn't mean shit anymore. <laughs> yes. So he just basically burns, but the auto regen just keeps him going. What do we do? Oh, the animation there went pretty hard. Wait! Skill, thought acceleration. Basically, we can think better, right? Faster. Mental process and speed. Four slice turn to future slice. How far into the future can we see? Oh. Yeah, they're both like gaining new skills as I fight, surpassing each other. This is looking pretty bad though. We haven't even scratched Araba yet. Is that the top? We've reached the top. There's no more way up. Uh, make the dragon break the wall. Ma make the dragon break the ceiling. Dodge. Yeah, not a sky dragon. This is some bullshit. Easy dodge. Our ass is on fire, but... Oh, medicine synthesis. I think that's the first time I've seen that one. Yeah, we got a healing version of it. Does this guy have any weaknesses? Alright, now we're going all the way back down. <laughs> Where's Mama Spider right now? If we can't beat it, can we bring someone that can beat it? You know what I mean? Just like start like running around and then somehow we run into Mama Spider. Where is she? Where the fuck is Mama Spider? I haven't seen her since episode one, man. It's looking so bad for us, dude. Like, I don't see us winning. We need like Mama Spider's intervention or something on that level. Maybe Admin D will like give us a power up for some reason. Oh? That's a dead end. Oh, that, no, 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 that's the fucking dragon skill. Now we're literally gonna die. A bullshit plot armor has to kick in. What is it? Cost me two? Two what? Oh, both eyes, gotcha. Holy shit. I didn't realize how OP annihilating I was. I know it's supposed to annihilate, but damn. That's the first time the dragon took any damage. I, it's only just like the the fingies, but... And can't we heal our eyes back up? No more webs? Oh! What did we just cut off? The thing that produces webs? To get out? She basically did the equivalent of like cutting your leg off to, because it was tied down, right? So she cut off the like the sack that like is, makes webs so she could escape from that. It's fine. As long as we level up, if we beat it, we can level up and all this healing will be done. Dude, we need some kind of plot armor! This is bullshit dragon, dude! And then what, though? We're just gonna keep going up and down? Okay, and back we go up. Oh, in the fire, though. We got, like, flame resistance, yeah? Maybe? 
<laughs> the dragon probably like, again? Are you serious? Oh! Yo, this is looking super bad! There's no way we're gonna win this at this rate! But we have... Oh, if we run out of MP, we don't have the lethal skill again. Like the, uh, the endurance one. Okay. Rot the dragon's mouth. Heal up again. And go back up. Oh, the, she looks so sad right now. This is looking so bad. Like, there's no way. Plot armor. What's the plot armor? Who's gonna come in? No, no, no. Job's not done yet. Don't give up. Holy shit, this is such a slow motion, man. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. Main character speech. What's the plan? All of it? All six eyes? What are we gonna do? Oh, the resolve is made, man. Was that it? That, that, that was way too quick. That was it, that was it. Boom. What, the dragon's not dead. No, it just took one hit, right? If the dragon's dead like that, that's kind of bullshit, in my opinion. Because that means that we could have done that from the beginning. <laughs> no, no shot, the dragon's dead, right? Ugh. I'm just waiting for, like, the, the appraisal to say threshold achieved, evolves, or some shit, huh? I know she has eight eyes, but she used two of them. For the abyss. Whoa, 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 wait! Arama looks pretty damaged. Oh, okay, okay. I thought it was M percent W equals I. I was like, oh, wait, wait. We, we do have slot, slot. M percent of the power necessary to achieve God. Wait, no, no, no. It is that path to Godhood again. Slot? Amplifies the depletion rate of the system's resource values and surrounding, excluding user additional grants the ability to exceed the... What is the W system, though? And interfere with the MA field. So MA field is what we learned about, like, the PowerPoint presentation intro last episode, right? It was like, humans discovered the MA field or MA something, right? And then that turned into, like, the lifespan or, like, like life, like being almost extinct in the earth and the dragon started attacking, but all right. Slot, another seven cents. You're right! Pride? Sloth? What else do we have? Is, is, is it only pride and sloth? I don't think we have like greed, envy. It's only two we have, right? I forget the other ones. What, what is there? There's like en lust. <laughs> lust sounds... We have wisdom? I didn't... Wisdom is a sin? What? I didn't realize that wisdom was a sin. So, is it collecting all the seven deadly sin skills that means that's the percent to goddess? So when we collect all seven, that's the percentage? I don't know. Do we have gluttony? She's just always hungry. Someone said that because, uh, I don't know, spiders have some kind of... They're, they're structured in a way to like eat a shitload. Okay, wisdom is a virtue. It's, 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 not a, it's not a sin, right? But okay, okay, interesting. So now what? Are we just gonna chill together? So all oh, he's drained out of everything. Gotcha, gotcha. We did pretty fucking good. I can't believe the like the annihilating eyes that strong though, huh? This is flashback when he was when she was planning. <laughs> the skills here are like uh, flipped. Up, oh, wait, no, they're just basically horizontally. Why did you horizontally flip this shit? I thought it'd be funnier if the skills got like upside down. Maybe this is upside down actually. No, oh, never mind. I'm stupid. It's still it's it's not upside down. It's just horizontally flipped. I thought it was like vertically flipped because she's a spider and she's like you know hanging upside down. Sloth. Op. This makes them burn all the resources. That's right. If you run out of stamina, you can't do anything. Now you just got sitting duck. Oh, here we go. It's kind of funny how she doesn't have arms right now because they're just, you know, cut off. But she's still doing this. No, I think he respects you, I think. Oh, this is before the flash. Oh, my bad, my bad. This is before the first encounter where Adama apparently let us go because we were like worth nothing, right? I see. She took that personally, man. She took that actually personally. Oh, oh. He's up! Maybe we spent too much time monologuing. Wait. Uh-oh. 
What does that look? Wait, wait, wait. All the skills are going away. All the skills went away. HP's going down. Is he killing himself? Oh, because he's just giving up right now. I never knew Wakaba had this kind of side. Like, it's almost like she's upset. Like, this is the sanctity of our duel. You and me. What do you mean? Like, I... What the fuck? I didn't know Wakaba had this kind of heart. Like, she's like a fucking samurai. What? <laughs> this is actually hype. got so deep all of a sudden what the fuck is she projecting herself at him right now she is projecting her values onto him right whoa, 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 what, was what was that what was that what was that there was some skills there earth dragon uh, this is the first time we met yeah this is the first time we met why is this getting so emotional what the fuck i thought you were just a random dragon we're gonna beat but what was like she's like trauma dumping When I'm struggling so hard to keep going. Cause like, all this time, all I've seen from Wakaba is her just like, oh, this sucks, but it is what it is. And she had like a cheerful mood. She's always had like a cheerful, positive outlook on life and she continued to move forward. But like, you knew she was struggling all this time. And now she, everything is just pouring out. And because Arava won't do the same, at least acknowledge and like, but come on, like we're at, we're at the end here. Are you seriously just gonna give up? Damn. <laughs> And this has to relate back to her personality as Wakaba back on Earth, right? Oh! What the fuck was that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Her... Whose eyes went... Gold there? Kumo's eye... This is the left eye though, right? No, this is not the one that's been hurt by the annihilating. So, the able eye turns gold. And he just... Disappears. Is, is that an eye attack? Was that an annihilating eye again? I'm just. Oh, is it? Because annihilating eye. It, it, I, I didn't get like a good visual cube for it because people would just kind of get cut off or like shit would just disappear. But all right, she just turn into light. Damn. Level up. Oh hey, new form? No. No. But I feel empty. Because the conclusion was not satisfactory. Damn. I think that... I don't, I don't know. Something about that entire interaction. The way that Wakaba was like pouring her heart out. Like, I didn't think that this fight was that deep. But at the end, it was. She was so mad and upset. Because like, what Araba was doing kind of like makes... Her entire existence, her efforts to survive, moot? You know, it's like, what does that make me if you're just gonna give up like that? It's like me, you, something, some being that you thought was worth nothing. Now, finally, I'm about to defeat you, but it's like, you're just gonna give up like that? Where is this all coming from? I never knew Wakaba was like this. She actually has, like, the heart of a samurai. You know what I mean? Holy shit. This is so emotional out of nowhere. The way that she just, like, walks away at the end after Araba disappears and like, a single tear is falling down. Damn! I thought we were just having fun schizo spider moments, but... Dude, I'm having an existential crisis right now. And I wonder if this is going to carry forward as she becomes a demon lord. And... <laughs> there she is right there. I, I like her, like, her hair is very interesting because it's like... She got the regular black haired bangs going down. But then she has like a slick of white here, right? And the slick of white, maybe like, I don't know, it, spider silk? I don't know, spider color. But anyways, who's Balto again? Have you encountered a dragon? The Balto is our... It's Manabu. It's Anos. Damn. <laughs> they, they put a lot of details on her right here. Did you, did you see that? Right over here. I'm not sure if this is a belly button. Maybe it is. But like the fact that they would like show a little cut and a little 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 fold here that's like that's like cherry on top detail <laughs> and she has like her eyeliner if you look at it it's like green here right so it's like red in the bottom but like green in the top 
like poison. I don't know. It's it's cool details. Like there's like she's obviously like a humanoid form, but there's like some spider resemblances around, you know? Yeah, Araba. Now you can fight Faye. Faye's not ready yet. There's Yuri! It's not Yuri though! It's the church it's not the church girl. The Earth Dragons are the strongest dragons? There's a church girl! Why is she just standing behind doing nothing? What is she what is she doing? That's the spider silk scarf. No, she's not. She's a 10 squadron leader. But the scarf survived the annihilating eye. Are you sure? I shouldn't. I feel like you're gonna die next. Blonde girl. Uh, oh, it's Okacha! Okacha, what are you doing? Okacha, what are you doing? And Hugo? Hugo. Hugo and this is spooky. My guess is this is spooky. Spooky has a reincarnated into the demon side and is basically taking advantage of Hugo. Yeah, that's that's my guess. Hugo? So he's looking pretty happy. Looks like he's trained. He's got some new powers. So Shun versus Hugo. Now, I would like for Shun to like take out his rage on Hugo and for Hugo to get dumpstered again. Because like maybe Shun is like super upset. And maybe Hugo will make fun and be like, oh, where's Julius? And maybe Shun will like just just destroy Hugo, right? And then fuck Hugo more. Or Hugo wins. And now it's the downfall of Shun arc. Who knows? Ending? No? What is this? What is this? What, 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 what is that? No, 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 that's Faye, that's Faye, that's, that's Faye in the day. No, that's Faye, that's Faye. That's Faye, because she turned into an egg, right? That's Faye, yeah, 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 that's right. She's like evolving, getting ready to evolve, right? Faye and Wakava, you know, she bullied us, and we met her in the past, too. Oh, she's finally getting out of the labyrinth, dude. Are we really not gonna say bye to Mama Spider? What about Mama Spider? Well, as soon as the spider takes a step outside a labyrinth, is this the same thing? Like, is the entire world gonna be like, holy shit, what just happened? You know, like how Veldora, like leaving the, like, you know how Rimuru is like Veldora Aura leaving the cave? You know what I mean? Yeah, it was pretty painful. It was, it's a nightmare here. She's graduating the labyrinth. Are you sure? I doubt it. Sunny new spider life. I don't think so. Finally, took us like 11 episodes, but we're finally out of the labyrinth. And? Mama? Mama, is that you? What you doing, Mama? No shot, Mama's not gonna let us leave, right? What if Mama just like prevents us from leaving at the very end? Cause finally, after episode one, where she tried to eat us, she's been hidden. But now she comes back as we leave the labyrinth? What is going on? I'd like to think Mama Spider is the queen spider that took out um, whatever the human faction was when, you know, a couple episodes ago, they were talking about how a fort went down, right? And apparently, like, a, a queen Tara tech took it out. So, I hope that's mama, but... Alright, she's finally back, but that's the episode. Today's episode was somehow really emotional. Like, I thought it was just gonna be a fun hype fight, new magics, you know, experiencing some desperation, some dire situation. And yes, this is the most dire situation we've ever been in. This scene right here... Or Kuma was just like laying on top of the foot, uh, the, the foot holding while the dragon was about to fucking shoot a beam at us. And she had like the whole speech of like, I did well, right? Didn't I do well? This is the strongest thing in the labyrinth. Well, I don't know if it actually is. Probably Mama is. But, you know, like, she was like, oh shit, is this it? I did well, right? But then she's like, no, not yet. This isn't, job's not done. Then she got up and used an annihilating eye. That she was super cool. But even beyond that was like this emotional sentiment between like two warriors like she even said like she's got like a, she, she was saying like, like something about warriors right when she was in like this humanoid form like she's got like the heart of a samurai she's like this is the sanctity of our duel you're just gonna give up like this at the end well, come on it's like wow that shit came out of nowhere i would have never expected this kind of moment in this anime straight up this is like almost as emotional as like like a stand proud your strong moment you know it was like one of those moments very emotional at the end of a fight but hey we fucking won and we defeated it and now we've leveled up we're not into the demon lord just yet because there's got to be some kind of like change right because wakaba gotta evolve again and somehow we gotta become a demon lord does the N percent, you know past the godhood imply that you need to collect all seven deadly sin skills like we have pride and sloth which means that we need five more. Which means that we're going to do a lot more farming outside the world, huh? But that's it from me. Hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. 
check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.